This past June 17, On One Photo Raw 2024 released their latest update, 2024.5, with all improved AI masking. In this video, we're going to be finding out whether this indeed is a big update that significantly enhances the masking experience. In case you didn't know, this is the first time a masking tool was updated since 2022 when On One introduced point and click masking with Super Select AI. To understand the improvement, let's remind ourselves how the previous version of AI masking worked. In case you didn't know, On One has two tools to perform AI masking with roughly equivalent functionality Super Select AI and Quick Mask AI. I've discussed Quick Mask AI in another video, so for this video, I'll be using Super Select AI, which has undergone the bigger change. To demonstrate the operation of the previous Super Select AI, let's try to mask this portrait. To perform a local adjustment, I'll click the Super Select AI tool. I'll hover over the portrait to make the selection, which as you can see, appears as a red overlay. Next, I'll click the mouse to create the mask, which turns the overlay blue. As you can see, for this particular task, this tool works great. That is if all I wanted to do was to select the entire portrait. But what if I wanted to select not just the entire portrait, but part of the portrait, say the eyes, face, hair, or lips? In the old Super Select AI, you couldn't do that. You can hover all day long as I'm doing here. Super Select will stubbornly refuse to select anything other than the entire portrait. And there lies the weakness of Super Select AI. It can't select any object it doesn't previously recognize. Here's another example. Once again, as you can see here, all I can select is the entire person and the dog. Also, if my intention was to select just the person, it is not even doing an adequate job, as the table and chair is being included with no way to exclude it except via manual brushing. Another annoyance of the previous Super Select AI is the user interface. If I needed to make an adjustment, as I'm doing here, I would need to look at an overly complicated menu to perform even the most minor adjustment. Not a great user experience, if you ask me. The problem is also not limited to just portraits. Here is Super Select AI having trouble selecting the transport vehicle in the background accurately. So that was the previous version. Let's now move on to the current version of Super Select AI. In 2024.5, Super Select AI is no longer limited to just masking previously recognized objects. As you can see here, I can now select the hair, the face, the eyes, and the lips with no problem whatsoever. The new Super Select AI also now supports dual modes of selection, point and click, and drag a rectangle over the object. This workflow seems to be copied from Capture One's masking, which introduced the workflow in last year's major upgrade. This is a good move in my view, as Capture One's masking is best in class. Moving on to the second image, you can see that I can now select the person much more accurately by selecting the individual parts. Better still, the overly complicated menu with a dizzying array of choices has now been greatly simplified. Moving on to the third image, you can see that once again, I can select the entire person or parts of the person. Also, the transport in the background is now easily masked with Super Select AI. So those are the improvements in Super Select AI, but are there any limitations? Well, yes, there are. The limitations are largely the same as that I've outlined in my previous video on Quick Mask AI tips. 
For example, you cannot create a mask with a brush and then continue adding to that mask with Super Select AI. You also cannot use Super Select AI to erase from a mask as you can do with other object selection tools like Capture One. Finally, let's answer the question, is Photo Raw 2024.5 a big update? Definitely yes. AI object masking is the most powerful form of masking. On One now joins leading raw editors like Lightroom and Capture One as the only other raw editor to offer competent AI object-based masking. Add to the fact that On One offers this as a free update for Photo Raw 2024 users and that this already follows a free upgrade to denoising, which is excellent, in 2024.3. It solidifies Photo Raw as the raw editor which delivers the most value at its price. Congratulations to the On One team for a great release. Let me know your thoughts on 2024.5. Write it down in the comments. I'd love to hear from you. And if you like this content, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share to help keep the videos coming. Until the next video, I'm going to see you in the next one. Bye for now.